Hi friends, you need a perfect website for your growing business and you can create a wonderful website using WordPress CMS and a good combination of theme. At WP Themes channel, we bring all the well-tested and hand-picked WordPress theme for your upcoming website projects. In this video, we are going to overview a multi-purpose WordPress theme called Capital and Capital is a perfect business theme and you can use this theme for any business professional website and you can see this these are some websites made with the capital WordPress theme and these websites are really presenting the content in a very specific manner but stop don't choose this theme until you understand the complete functionality the installation process and the available options uh, with the theme pack because you never know what functionality need functionality will you may need in the future and how you can make with the use of the theme so all these things can be known by uh, watching this complete video and we are going to overview the complete feature of theme along with the installation process and uh, demo import process basic customization so that you may understand everything about the theme and then make your decision so uh, watch this video until end because it is going to be important if you really want a serious website for your business and also so be with me i am going to tell you one uh, or two tips for your wordpress website during the video so let us proceed so capital is a multi-purpose business wordpress theme and it has been developed by IMI themes and IMI themes are power elite authors this theme came into existence in 2017 and uh, the regular updates for this theme is also being done time to time and capital is a full functional powerful wordpress theme designed and developed for finance consulting corporate and other business websites so you can uh, have a wonderful a stunning website using this theme so uh, it is compatible with the WooCommerce as well. So you, if you, if you want to run an e-commerce website, you can use this theme. And um, 12 header layouts and variations are, are already included in the design blocks and online shop options is here. So you are going to get everything that you need for a business website. So without any further delay, let us proceed towards the installation of this capital WordPress theme so that we may understand the complete features and functionality. And this is a core installation of WordPress with me and I am assuming you have already installed the WordPress at your hosting uh, at your domain and if not you may please follow the link given in the, in the description of this video where you can get the domain where you can get the hosting plan along with the pre-installed theme along with the uh, selected demo website so everything is available just follow the link well, only one link is there in the description and you will get everything there okay so this is a fresh installation and it is running 5.9 wordpress version and 2022 default wordpress theme and i got the theme pack in the theme pack i have demo content that is demo 1 2 3 4 has been supplied in the requisite formats and we can import the demo content using this files just in case if you are we are not going to use the automated demo import and this is the main theme file and child theme file is here and licensing and documentation has also been included in the theme pack so let us use these files for our installation to install the theme we have to be in the appearance section of wordpress and click on themes and further we have this default 2022 wordpress theme as of now on this installation we can click on add new upload theme choose file and here we need to choose the capital.zip file so remember you have to choose only capital.zip file you don't need to upload the complete folder it is going to be a mistake and bug uh, it's going to create a bug for your installation so you have to select capital.zip and again if you are having direct access on your file manager using the control panel or ftp you can upload the same file directly to uh, wp content themes folder i am doing the same i wish to save some time and wish to show you the theme file size in fact so theme file size is just 18.14 mb and it is an indication of well optimized 
WordPress theme and it is going to work very fast on your website so we can check the speed here on the demo website and it is working very fast and you can see the stunning look along with the super lightning speed so everything uh, now depends on the speed in fact a well performing website fast loading website can only be indexed at the search engine in a proper manner so speed is the key for the success of any website nowadays and if you are not having the speed your website might be uh, looking so good but it is not going to be successful it is very clear so you are going to get a speed fast loading website using this theme so it is important okay so uh, it also depends on your hosting plan and uh, this is why we are offering a perfectly optimized hosting plan for your wordpress website you just follow the link and you will get everything so i am repeating again again and again so you have to select a, a hosting plan that comes with a pre-installed theme along with the demo content so that you may start your website very quickly as you can okay so now we can see the progress bar is turned green with 100 percent and we can go back and extract the uploaded file and the extraction outcome is going to bring some this is my cost it is not required just delete it, it immediately and this is capital folder that we got from extraction and it is containing everything uh, of the theme and now we can delete the zip one as well because we have already extracted it okay fine so we can come back to the themes screen and we have now this capital as another theme option along with the default theme let us check the details this is capital version 2.4 responsive what was theme designed and developed for corporate business portfolio website by imi themes okay wonderful so let us activate this theme and upon activation we got an alert that we need to install certain plugins in order to get the complete features and functionality of the theme let us go to the plugin installer screen and these are the list of plugins and 12 plugins have are here and five are marked as required and rest are recommended only but yes uh, in the initial stage we need to install all the plugins so that we may got we, we may get um, the complete features of the theme just in case if you are not using any of these features that are coming from these plugins you can deactivate and delete those plugins that you are not using so let us overview what is here woocommerce is definitely for e-commerce activity it is new mce for widgets and and this is twitter feeds sidebars and water market is not so required contact form 7 is here for creating contact form that is for navigation breadcrumb and this theme uses wp bakery page builder a wonderful page builder of course and it has a combination of redux framework that the redux framework and the wp bakery, bakery page builder is a great combination of technology and it is going to work very fine revolution slider is for slider image area meta box for and capital core is here for the main plugin as for the same so we are going to install all these plugins and all plugins can be installed in a single click and i am installing all plugins in one go and if you are not confident about your server capacity just install the plugin one by one to avoid any error during the plugin installation process okay so plugins are being installed now and it may take a bit time just be on the screen don't replace the okay so now you can see the, all the plugins got installed within seconds and this is the beauty of hosting plan that we are using and providing you just don't skip this grab the opportunity and it comes uh, at almost no price in fact so go back to the return return back to the plugin installer screen and now it is time to activate all the installed plugins and it can also be done in a single click okay so now i am activating and okay so all plugins got installed without any trouble without any error and it is successful so all plugins installed all set of plugins are here on our installation and we have now the theme and plugins installed and it is redirecting to woocommerce installation completion page so what we can do we can skip this woocommerce information page for the timing it can be done later 
so because we are not going to create exactly e-commerce website so I am skipping this however WooCommerce has also been installed so it is not a problem we can use the functionality of WooCommerce as well and now we are fine with the plugins and we can take a look of our website how it looks uh, with the theme and all set of plugins okay so this is the look of website and it is using the capital wordpress theme and it is clean and clear as of now because it don't have any content so at this stage we need to import a demo content set so that we may create a website like any of these these any can uh, be a target website for this so so all pieces are really wonderful so it is actually a corporate website and you are going to get a perfect website for your business using this thing so, okay so let us proceed towards importing the demo content come back to the dashboard and i'll show you what we got additional in this installation and what are the theme options and what these tabs are bringing uh, at your at, at our website so let us first proceed towards importing the demo content and i will find okay so under theme options the demo importer is available and we can simply click on the demo importer under theme options and here we have redux framework warning ACHS CDN some controls may not render properly please wait a few minutes try refreshing this page okay we may refresh this it will work I believe okay so now it is working and now we have this option to select what we want at your uh, at our websites in fact every, uh, every all the uh, layouts looking very good to me and you can select any uh, of these available website as per your requirement and choice and i'm choosing this demo too it is really looking good to me so i'm importing this one and you can choose any as per your choice but i'm importing this demo too and it is simple and I am clicking now so now a screen is going to show what is going on and it is simply saying please wait so don't refresh this page don't hit the back button and we have to wait on this screen and it is going to take time in fact so it may take up to 5 or 10 minutes even and it depends on your server capacity and the speed of internet and every dependable things are here so don't disturb hinder the process just wait until you get any message on the screen and meanwhile you can check whether everything is going fine so we, we can open the media library in another tab and we should have some media content here and yes so we are getting the media content and as of now 31 media items has been imported and we can keep refreshing this page just to check and it is not necessary thing so 32 is now a score so it is going to take time because it is it is connected to the developer server for importing the certain files of demo websites so we have to wait here and after four or five minutes i got 82 media items and i believe this is stuck now and it is not increasing and this is a very simple trick to check uh, uh, the demo import process and if it is somehow stuck so we what we can do so it is still saying uh, please wait we can check the pages as well however i am sure we have not received any page so we have not received any page as of now so what we can do we can rephrase this page and while i was saying don't refresh this page and if somehow it is stuck at any stage we can refresh this page and repeat the process and this will complete the demo import process so this is a very simple and effective trick with, uh, that i have seen so we can re-import and so uh, media items was 82 before re-importing and we can check this again so it is it should now increase and if it is increasing it will work fine and yes so it is increasing now it is now 89 so it is a very simple trick and just in case if your import is also mm, stuck in at uh, any stage you can use this rephrase option but yes you have to check the continuously the media items before doing so because it is going to overwrite the 
data or it is it may also bring duplicate contents at your website so you have to be careful and meanwhile while okay so it is very simple now it is simply saying imported and yes we can we are fine with this set of images and uh, we will check the pages as well so let us first so 89 media items has been provided and we can check the pages and yes so 22 pages are also here so we can now conclude that the uh, the demo import is really complete and it is time to take another look of our website so this was the initial website before importing the demo content and now we have this great one yes it is complete actually and we have this wonderful website and it is really a professional website and you as you seen the import demo import process and the installation process really remained very cool and successful and we don't face any difficulty so now we can conclude that this theme is going to be useful and uh, purposeful for us and we can check the inner pages and it is really good and so about the spaces here and project base so it is really good of course and services you can check so service created here so it is this the colors can be changed just in case if you want and these are the services okay wonderful so the all pages are working very fast and you can see it is really uh, fast and cool and all pages has been crafted and designed in a very specific so these are elements available uh, for your website so you can use this you know, analytical elements or such things for your website also so now we have completed the installation and we got this website in our installation process as we chosen as our demo website and all things are fine and i believe this is the uh, website and okay so so now we have completed our installation and now we can go back to the dashboard to overview what is available here so i am coming back back to the dashboard and i'll show you quickly what are the additional tabs available here and what the tabs are bringing so projects team uh, team and services are new tabs so i will open these three event testimonials is also you know, all vc sections so i'm just opening the new things just to give an uh, overview so services can be uh, controlled from the services option and we can edit the existing services page and we can even edit the uh, add new services and if you are not editing these these services and um, you can delete these because you don't have to keep any inactive content at your website uh, because it is going to index by the search engine so just edit these pages or delete these pages and this is being the services similarly team is here so i will show you what team tab or team area is so this is team area and this is the team button okay so similarly projects can be headed in the project section and okay so this is the look of project page okay and i'm just giving you overview you have to edit these contents and testimonials are similarly testimonials are available here so okay so it is not exactly being used so okay and the vc sections like footer and overlay sidebar overlay sidebar and services single pages and these sections can be handled from here uh, so we see sections like footer is to be controlled from here so just in case if you want to use this area so these are the some additional tabs and i'll show you okay so now what is next here so theme options definitely i'll show you the theme options 
and rest of things are as common as in WordPress. So I am going to show you the theme options. I'll just give you an overview quickly. So this is general setting and here the enable maintenance mode and uh, some admin logo admin logo can be custom ad admin login logo can be changed from here so it is good thing that we can white label our login screen as well and similarly responsive can be on layout can be set here content and transparent content and some uh, more settings are here header can be set featured buttons and so the, in the header we have multiple options we can select any header type so just in case if you want to change the header you can select this header and save, uh, save changes so it will change the header style i believe and yes so it is it has changed the header style so that is just take a header of course and uh, so these are the header options as well so we can everything is working fine and now we, i will save to the default one so what was earlier and you can choose any style uh, similarly uh, featured buttons can we get a code uh, link and so don't keep any external link on your website just it is very important thing and it is a common mistake by the developers and even experts made made this mistake and they don't check the external links and it is going to impact the ssl certificates as well so you have to keep in mind you have to check all the external links and there is a video on this channel only how you can check the external links uh, if it is available on your any of your web page so okay so background color and the background color image hover background and uh, like hover background color transparent so you can select the hover background here and then just like save okay and you can use all these elements for like button and all things are here button three and okay so these are the settings for featured buttons and similarly header info can be changed from this area so again and there is an external link and you have to take care no external link should be used at your website social links overlay content and search form logo can be changed from here top bar stick a header and you can uh, simply uh, select what you want to keep sticky so logo card and featured button so everything is in your control this is great setting in fact and mobile header you can see it's in a pages header sidebars and footers can be controlled from these screens so this is sections footer has been as i shown you copyright draw and all things color scheme you can hand, uh, handle uh, you, if you want to put your custom color you can use or you can use the default as well typography complete control on your fonts more options additional styles blog custom js and rest of things are as common so we have the complete control on your on our website and we got this wonderful website in our installation and i am sure it, this theme is really going to be helpful for your business website and we can now conclude that this theme is wonderful and it is working fine so everything is good with this theme and just in case if you have any question regarding this theme installation customization and all such things you can simply get in touch with us by following the link given in the description of this video and you can also write any comment uh, for this video so uh, if you like this video don't forget to give a thumbs up and you can select this theme now and i am going to come with another wordpress resources in the next video keep watching keep building thank you